Okay, replacing the tub spout today. Good idea to wrap some tape around the jaws to protect the finish of your new one. Thread it in, tub spout. It's slightly tricky because there's not much room, but should be enough. The old one, don't care about too much. Just turn it out. You can see a big old giant hole in it. Darn it, got the extension with it. So I'm gonna need to take that out. Okay, I was able to get the old faucet deal off there. So just gonna be wrapping some Teflon tape around this puppy. Gonna be going with the threads here so it turns in as tighten it in. That way the Teflon tape doesn't come come off as we tighten it on. And just skipping the first one or two threads. And the same on the other side. Okay, I'm gonna go with the threads. Here. There we go. Beautiful. Now I'm gonna reach inside there and just kind of pull any little bit of debris out of there. And I'm gonna insert insert see in there much but that's okay just gonna put it in there nice and tight tighten it down here with my channel ox And before I get too far there, I'll go ahead and prove it. Just turn the water on. I'm just going to turn it on gently and then feel inside there. Won't really be able to see much, but we'll be able to feel it if it's anything funky squirting out of there. So there we go. Open the water line just a little bit. We're looking, looking dry there. Everything's good. So I go ahead and put the tub spout on. Now for the tub spout, most of it we're just going to be turning on by hand. And the last little bit, if we need to, we'll use our channel locks for the very last turn. We probably really won't even need to. going to kind of protect the, the head and wrap our jaw with jaws with tape here but There we go. It looks like we need to come back the other way just a tiny bit. Now we'll prove it out. Here we go. No leaks. One nice new tub shot. Good job. 